Good morning guys, what is happening, what is going on, what is good, hope you have a fantastic day guys, today we're doing another reaction video guys, if you want to support the channel, make sure you buy my merch, this is me when I was like 12 years old, can you believe that, that I'm just kidding by the way, I'm not selling this shit, I'm not selling merch, but can you believe this was me when I was like 12 years old, <laughs> how crazy is that, look at that, freaking new metal haircut, <laughs> guys what has happened, hope you guys are all doing fantastically well, um, this is the last reaction video that I'm gonna be doing before I go away on holiday. In fact, by the time I release this, it'll, I'll probably freaking be back. I just love being ahead of schedule. It's so awesome. So guys, today we're doing something that has been highly requested by you all. You guys have... Okay, sweet. I was just making sure that the microphone was turned on. Uh, you guys have been requesting this so much, so we are doing it. Deftone sex tape. Now, let's face it. We always wonder, what is a Deftone song about? Is it about sex? most of the time it is, they decided to just answer it for us. Sex tape, most likely about Kim Kardashian or any other like D-list celebrity who decided to, they wanted to become like a B, C, a C-list celebrity. So guys, you know what to do. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. You know, all that good stuff. I'm not gonna waste my time doing that kind of shit because you know what to do. Uh, if you don't, if you're new, subscribe, like, click that notification bell button and comment would be greatly appreciated. Guys, let's rock and roll. No bullshit here, baby. Ooh, I, already the first like three notes, I'm in love. Very chill. I, f I just wanna be in like a bathtub right now, bubble bath, listening to this. I'm sorry. That is beautiful. Oh, what a voice. Guys, I'm sorry I paused it. I'm sorry. That was beautiful. I was not expecting that. Oh, okay. Fucking that voice. Guys, I will go gay for him. I swear to God. The funk's coming. The funk is coming. Guys, I feel uh, I feel like the song is this song is too good for me to listen to. Does that ever, does that make sense? Have you guys ever felt that way about a song where you're just like, this is way too good to listen to like this. I need to like set shit up. Like see for this song, I need to go to a hotel. I need to beautiful bathtub, lots of bubbles, candles. And then you just put the song in the background. That's what I feel like I need to be doing. I'm ruining the song the first time listening to the song. Be guys already I'm in love with just everything about it. I'm pausing that shit. I'm, I don't give a fuck if you guys are like, you ruined it, you ruined it. I need to mentally prepare for this part now because it just, the two seconds, it's just beautiful. Oh my God. It just got better. Right. Turning it up. Fucking hell. Oh, I'm melting. I'm melting. <laughs> Guys, I'm melting. Oh! 
Guys, I gotta stop it. That note, he just went even more beautiful with that. Tonight! Oh my god. The cr Guys, I'm sorry. I have to keep pausing this. This is just... I feel like I'm being spoiled by you guys and by them. You guys giving me the song to do. I'm sorry, man. But Jesus Christ, this is... This is beautiful. Creamy. I just melt every time he just fucking says something. Every time the guitar tone. Every time the guitar string. Every time the, the, the drum comes in. I just melt. Everything is so beautiful about this. Okay, guy, I, I'm sorry. I want to really prepare for this. I want to listen to this chorus. Guys, you ready for this shit? You ready? Ready? Let's do this. Oh, uh, let's let guys. Let's go on this journey together. Oh, oh my God, this is beautiful. Oh my God, man. My God, my God. Guys, I did not deserve that song. I did not deserve that at all. I was not expecting that from that song. Easily my favorite Deftone song. Easily, every note. It's like, once again, sleeping in my bathtub, bubbles everywhere. The song, candles, lights off. The song just takes you and like, you know when you go down to the bubble bath and you just come out into space, that's what the song is like. It just, every time, it just takes you somewhere different, somewhere far, man, somewhere beautiful. My God. So, you guys know how I feel about the instruments and everything because let's face it, fucking very obvious throughout the song. Guys, let's go straight into this beautiful poem, this beautiful story. Let's see what he's talking about here. From Mancino Moreno discussed this lament about spiritual isolation with art, artist direct. Said Moreno, I love that one. It jumps around a lot. I was going to fix it so every verse told one cohesive story. But I decided that I really like it the way it is. It's really fragmented. Pieces of information are in different places. Under the water and in the city. Fuck. It's broad and it feels really good. Yes, it does, Chino. It adapts to the overall vibe. Yes, it does. It has a nighttime feel to it as well. Yes, it freaking does. We've been playing it in rehearsal and I realized how much I like it now. When I first wrote it, I thought you could tell this is one of my songs. It's probably the most Team Sleep-esque song on the record. I didn't want it to be too self-indulgent right off the bat or for people to think this is Chino just being Chino. Really, it's not. Everybody contributes on that song fairly equally. I wrote the opening riff, but the song grew from everybody building onto that. Beautiful, man. It's more of a Deftone song than people might believe it is. Playing the song in rehearsal, it sounds mighty for that simple fact that it doesn't have any crushed guitar. No, it doesn't. Screaming or anything aggressive on it. Sex tape sounds really big. It does. It's so weird how like it sounds so big, but so calm. The more calm it is, the more big it is. It's like like cityscapes. 
I can do like New York City or Dubai from like a fucking huge, like a skyscraper. You just, not even a skyscraper actually. Like just a normal building. You just look out and you just see Los Angeles from like the hills, Hollywood Hills. That's what this is, man. Floating underwater, ever changing. Picture hours out from land. In tune with all our dreams, the ocean takes me and to watch you shake it. No, you know what I'm gonna do, guys? I'm gonna start that again, but I'm gonna be proper like uh, audio book type. All right, guys, you ready? Ready to fall asleep with me? <clears throat> Floating underwater, ever changing. Picture hours out from land in tune with all our dreams. The ocean takes me in to watch you shake it, watch you wave your powers, tempt with hours of pleasure. Take me one more time. Take me one more wave. Take me for one last ride. I'm out of my head. I fucked that up, guys. Shit. Tonight, 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 I. I love that. Tonight, I. The sound of the waves collide. Tonight, we ride. Oh, fucking hell. That's beautiful, man. Cruising through the city after hours with me fusing all of our powers. Here's to all our dreams. That's stunning, man. Take me one more time. Take me one more wave. Take me for one last ride. I'm out of my head. Tonight, 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 I. The sound of the waves collide. The sound of the waves collide. The sound of the waves collide. Tonight we ride. So, so simple. So simply written, but so beautiful. Floating underwater, ever changing. Picture hours out from land. So much imagery here. In tune with all our dreams, the ocean takes me. Ocean. Nighttime, water, all the most beautiful things to just keep you so calm, you know? Darkness, water, f flying, dreams, man. In to watch you shake it. I love that. It's kind of like risky, you know what I mean? Risque. Watch you wave your powers, tempt with hours of pleasure. That, that's sex, by the way. And then he just repeat cruising through this. I like that, cruising through the city after hours with me fusing all our powers, here's to all our dreams. I love that, here's to all, it's like a cheers, you know? Like we've accomplished something. I love that when, when, when like artists do that, here's to our, that's like a little cheers thing. Guys, this was so beautiful, oh my God, how long is this video? Not even that long. Jeez, all right, let's, I think we can talk, we can talk a little bit about it. Uh, I like, it's so beautiful. It's, what else can I say about it, man? This is like one of the most beautiful songs I've ever heard. It's so big. Do they even play this shit live? It's, I really don't want this to be one of those songs. Like it's one of the most epic songs and they never, okay, no. They've got actually a lot of live um, version of the songs. So I'm gonna have to check this out once I'm done with this video. You know what I really hate? They don't have professional recordings. I actually did this little thing. Um, like research, because you know how you always have bands with one concert, they'll have like a proper professional recording, they'll hire out like a film crew to record like blah blah blah, live at blah blah blah, this, live at this, Kendrick Lamar live at, you know, Madison Square Garden, Justin Bieber live at the Apollo, they don't have any of this stuff, why not? Is it because they want you to just come and like experience it for yourself? But I can't get to Meltdown Festival South Bank. I can't get to like Austin. I don't live there. I live in Glasgow, Scotland, man. To be fair, they've come here like twice, but I never, um, I never listened to them at that point. So I really hope they come back. I'm sure they will. I'm sure they will. Glasgow's like the, like every band comes through Glasgow. Every artist comes through Glasgow, actually. It's like music haven here, man. I could actually probably just go to like the the uh, the arena right now, and there will be like an artist playing there all the time. Um, guys, you know what? Nah, I'll save it for the next video. I was gonna do like shout outs because you guys are like commenting right now, but I'll wait till the next one. I'll wait till the beginning of the, uh, the video. But um, Aisha1994, thank you very much. I appreciate it. I'll do the rest like some other time. You were just like the first person that was here. Um, guys. I don't want to drag this any longer than it has to be. Let's just leave it at that. This was beautiful, man. Um, guys, thank you so much for this this suggestion. This was actually one of the best suggestions you guys have ever given me. Ever. I swear to God, you guys have given me some amazing shit. But this, this, 
this tops everything. Holy shit. Guys, once again, thumbs up if you enjoy my t-shirt with my freaking 13 year old face on it. Much appreciated. That's how we roll, guys. Anyways, peace.